mom wanted to go shelling, so we're going shelling. Three hour tour. Max is ordering bike parts off Amazon and having Mirabelle pick them up. This was our 2,000 mile round trip from Nashville, Tennessee to Everglades National Park. I did a video about the getting there and getting back in a two-year update because this is we've been RVing for two years. We saw lots of areas. We started off on the Everglades city side and wound up down at the Flamingo side in south, south, south Florida. Fun trip. That there's a big fork left. <laughs> We're about to go on that. So Naples, Florida was right up the road. We had, we had spent some time in the Everglades and we were breaking it up this day, not in the swamp. We decided to go to the, the big city. So we went to the Everglades. Emily wanted to do shelling on an island. So we found a boat tour that would take us out to a barrier island where we could do some shelling. And it was in Naples and Naples is high end. <laughs> we had been in Naples a night before, um, and it was, you could just tell, there's lots of money in Naples. And you can see here, um, some of the houses, I mean, the boats, the airplanes, the jets that were flying people in. So Naples, there's a lot of money in Naples, uh, which is why I will probably never reside in Naples. <laughs> and don't have a lot of use for Naples, to be honest. But it was beautiful. Uh, the boat tour out to the uh, Barrier Island was awesome. We saw some eagles. Uh, we saw some dolphins. We picked lots of shells. Uh, it started off kind of overcast in the morning, but it burned off and wound up being a beautiful day. And then on the way back, we toured around. As you saw, we saw some of the houses, and uh, the the guide talked about the different areas of Naples. Um, Naples is a beautiful town, um, but you better have your wallet with you. And it is crowded. We were there during the winter, um, so... South Florida in the winter is that's their season, so it was busy. Now, these are bottlenose dolphins. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, yeah, I think you got a whole bunch there. Got one over there. You got a whole bunch. Now, a group of dolphins are known as a pod. Two or more make a pod. And sometimes they go from one side to the other. So what are they doing? They are playing. They are more uh, uh, like the you than you know. So this was really cool. The We had quite a little journey out to the barrier island. I think it was called Key Waden Island. And it's you go up this kind of waterway, and there were boats coming in and out. Uh, it was like a parade of boats going out. But these dolphins that we found, they basically stayed in our wake almost the entire way. I mean, they just kept playing. They were jumping in the, you can kind of see them popping in and out here. But they just followed us and followed us. I mean, it was a pretty long way out, and they stayed with us almost the entire time. Very interesting. We can find more dolphins, but we ain't going to find more. It's an eagle. Look at it, look at it. Right there, look at that. Florida has the second largest population of bald eagles uh, behind uh, behind Alaska. So he moved to that tree, which is where his nest is. Oh, there's two of them. Well, that would mean they're not on eggs yet. That's pretty cool. You can see the two eagles. Yep. All right, guys, we're going to keep moving. You picked the right day, guys. And at that point, we headed on out, and we kind of, you docked right there on the side with the mangroves and walked across to the beach on the barrier island for shelling. Emily wanted to go shelling because she used to go shelling with her grandfather, Papa Bear. <laughs> I've never seen one that's not been broken before. Dang, Mom was excited about this. She was running up out here on this beach. <laughs> I think I'm probably going to leave my 
This is Emily's passion. What is it? Cat's paw? Cat's paws and turkey wings. Turkey wings? Would be what Papa Bear taught it. Papa Bear. The original, the I'm OG shower. This is so exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so silly. on the hunt for interesting shells. It's pretty interesting. There's tons of these guys. I'm trying to, I'm getting a bunch of them and I'm gonna pick the ones I like the best. Time to head back. Not enough time. What do you think? You're making me leave. <laughs> back to the boat. So many boats coming out. Alvin's Island in Naples. Doesn't seem like the place that would be in Naples. It's a lot bigger than Marco Island. The Marco Island beach. Very easy to get to. Eight bucks. Big parking lot. It's not like Naples. Naples Beach, very hard to get to. We gotta walk across the lagoon to get over to the Gulf. Alright. I don't think there's another way. <laughs> Renting a kayak. We did it. <laughs> we traversed the mighty river, the mighty lagoon. Now it's just turned disgusting. <laughs> Stinks like a swamp. So Max and Arden were going to race and I didn't have much faith in Max on this because Arden was a swimmer. <laughs> She's trained. So he, I think, ran and somehow held with her, but I mean, she obviously had it on the swimming front. So we had been in Florida at this point uh, several days, and this was the first time we'd actually been in the water. So we uh, got out of Naples. We tried to go to the, the beach at Naples at the pier, and that was a no-go. That was place was overrun with people, nowhere to park, nowhere to, you couldn't get access to it. Uh, we had walked on the pier the night before, so been there, done that. Got out of Naples, headed back south towards the Everglades Park where we were staying, and stopped at Marcos Island and kind of expected it to be a small uh, city. Had no clue. I mean, I'd done no research on it whatsoever. And it was actually a pretty big city and also a lot of money in Marcos Island. Uh, we didn't care about any of that. All we cared about was getting to the Gulf and <laughs> getting in the ocean. And my fat butt 
I was going to soak up some, I was going to get some sun on that beautiful body of mine. So I worked on that. Some of the prettiest sunsets I've seen that I can remember seeing in a long time we saw on this trip and this was one of them.